Hi, I'm Java Sana and welcome to this week's recap of Google Cloud Next on Air, focusing on productivity and collaboration. industry insights and we had all spotlights shined on the media and entertainment industry and as we navigate through each week's themes and topics we wanted to keep this industry focus in mind here's our recap on the two most relevant sessions for this week first we have G Suite's vision for your future workspace here Javier Soltero Google's Vice President and General Manager talked us through the future of G Suite, which is now renamed to Google's Workspace, and how to change the way teams work with solutions that are designed for humans and built for impact. Now, we have all been experiencing the accelerated shift to remote working due to COVID-19. And Javier emphasizes that this is not just a temporary situation, as COVID-19 is the catalyst that will keep accelerate the transition to more remote and distributed teams. And we're actually seeing this trend both from the employees and employee side of it, as 80% of the workspace would really like to have the flexibility to work from home at least some of the time and 74% of CFOs intend to shift some of their employees to work permanently from home after COVID-19. And the benefits are not just in employees seeking more flexibility. With remote working models, companies can save money, reduce their carbon footprint, which is great, and even repurpose their office space for other users. The second session I'd like to highlight is the Empowering Collaboration with Security. Hosted by Google's product managers Gagan Arora and Brad Meder, where they gave us an overview of Google's four security pillars. Secure collaboration, secure users, secure devices, and secure access. They also announced several new security features for chat, Gmail, and Meet including enhanced meeting knocking controls, advanced meeting locks, abuse reporting and detections, in addition to Google Chat being upgraded with new phishing protections. Today, more than 6 million companies have already chosen Google's workspace as their partner in the digital transformation. But what does productivity and collaboration in the new normal really mean for the media and entertainment industry. And for that, I'd like to hand it over to my colleague Michael Sheng, our Google Workspace specialist, to answer this. First, I'd just like to say thank you for having me, Jala. I really love what you're doing here. With regards to the media and entertainment industry, it's really all about the effective collaboration of creative people through the management of massive amounts of media content. And this content's going through rigorous creation cycles as well as the post-production workflows. A lot of these processes had been fairly static across the industry. Um, and over the, the last six months, a little bit plus, uh, we've seen a lot shift drastically. Going forward, content will not just be created inside the sophisticated media house digital studios we're used to. We're seeing reporters, editors, and, and really content creators at all levels leveraging technology in their homes and even on their lawns. Media staff have converted their homes to digital studios. Auditions are happening remotely. Storyboards and concepts are being brainstormed through digital collaboration platforms. Now, providing a digital workspace for your employees is just as important as providing a digital experience for your audience. It's imperative to meet the skyrocketing demand for content and entertainment. Whether you're an ad agency, a, a print and publishing company, or a film studio, and really regardless of your medium, your work has two parts, your ideas and your people. Google Workspace brings both of them together, really from any remote location across all of your connected devices. Your teams will have more creative freedom, more time, as they, they won't be stifled by IT maintenance, downtime, and, and working with unscalable tools which require hours just for installation and setup. Google Workspace has the collaboration and productivity tools that media and entertainment professionals rely on. It scales effortlessly and it secures you against any possible future disruptions, whether it's cataclysmic in nature or not. 
With that, I'd like to hand it back to you, Jala. Thanks again for having me. Thanks for that, Michael. And I hope you have all enjoyed this week's recap. And I look forward to seeing you next week, where we will be diving into infrastructure and security. So see you then. 